Hello everyone, welcome to HP Extreme, the new generation of hot process soap making. This is Sharon with Rose of Sharon Essential Skin Care, and I'm so blessed to have you join me today for the making of Wild Thing Hot Process Soap. Now did I have enough bass in my voice when I said that Wild Thing? Huh, definitely not. I think I'll just stick to soap making instead. Okay, back to serious matters. Let's get back to making soap. This soap was created using the SJHP SBHP 10 minute hot process method. You can learn more about this method and see just what others are doing by joining our Facebook group called Hot Process Soap Making with Sharon Johnson. And if you would like to get your copy of the ebook tutorial, which is now available, I will provide a link in the description box below. And for anyone who purchases the ebook tutorial, you now have exclusive access to the secret Facebook group called HP Extreme University. In this group, you can get all the help you need. So what are you waiting for? Head on over and get your copy today. Now, are you ready to make some soap? Well, let's get started. Now for the creation of this soap, I will be using squeeze bottles, which I purchased from the local Restaurant Depot store. I've also lined each bottle with a piping bag for easier cleanup. And I have fallen in love with using squeeze bottles with fluid hot process soap. I find I have so much more control over my batter and I can become more creative also. Now in the past I have created several tiger striped hot process soaps. However, it was very time consuming because I would actually use a spoon and spoon each row or layer of soap down the center of the mold and it just took a lot more time. And so using the squeeze bottles, it helps to speed up the process and it gives me more control and of course cleanup is a breeze so I'm very happy with this process. So to my dear friend Alyssa Lewis this video is especially for you. I know that you were interested in learning how to make tiger striped soap so here is my version using fluid hot process soap. Now for the recipe, I used the lard recipe which is included in the ebook and I used 38% water. So my soap has already been colored with my mica colorants and also the fragrance oil has already been added. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of the video.
So there you have it, the making of Wow Thing Hot Process Soap. Again, thank you so much for joining me today. And if you want to see more video tutorials, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Now before I go, I want to leave you with this. May God continue to bless you, keep you, and shine His face upon you. And remember, no matter what happened yesterday, today, or even tomorrow, God's mercies for you are new every morning. And there is absolutely nothing that you have ever done or even going to do that's going to separate you from God's love. For while we were still sinners, He still died on the cross just for us. So you never have to question whether God loves you because of your past or even your future. He has an everlasting love for us. Yes, God thinks of you. He looks after you. He cares for you because he loves you. So if you haven't already asked Jesus Christ into your heart, I encourage you to say this prayer with me. Dear God, I know I am a sinner. I believe Jesus died on the cross to forgive me of my sins. I now accept your forgiveness and offer of eternal life. Thank you for forgiving me of all my sin. From this day forward, I will choose to follow you. Amen. So if you said that prayer with me today, here is what the Word of God says about you, that you are a new creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. God bless you, and I can't wait to see you the next time.